Good morning students. Welcome to 5th standard social science class. Dear children, let us listen to the music. Early to bed, early to rise. Wish good morning, wish good night. Follow good habits, be a good boy. Bathe every day. Brush your teeth, comb your hair, and cut your nails. Follow good habits, be a good boy. Go wash your hands before and after your meal. Fight with germs and keep yourself clean. Dear kids, do you like this video? Always yourself clean. Dear children, in life, Values give us clear goals. They always tells us how we should behave and act in difficult situations and give the right direction to our life. In life, a person with good values can take better charge. A person is able to judge what is right and what is wrong based on the values he imbibes a person with good values is always likely to make better decisions than others dear children today we are going to learn about lesson 3 good citizen come children let us learn dear children do you remember what is the meaning of citizen a citizen is a person who is a member of a particular country and enjoys various rights and executes his duties. We are born with few values and rights. These values are further polished in educational institutions. The aim of education is to change a person into a valuable human being. Good values are the qualities of a person that keep the society running. These qualities can be developed by all. Good values can be divided into five types. They are personal values, cultural values, social values, disciplinary values and constitutional values. First, we will see personal values. Personal value is the Basic value for an individual. Personal values are broad desirable goals that motivate people's action and serve as guiding principles in their lives. Everyone has values, but each person has a different value set. Personal values are desirable to an individual and represent what is important to someone. A good citizen is always respectful. Some personal values are love, mercy, generosity, honesty, truth, friendship, hospitality, peace, tolerance, faith and so on. Mercy Mercy, forgiveness shown towards someone whom it is within one's power to punish. Generosity Generosity is happy to give time, money, food or kindness to people in need. Honesty Honest is perfect for describing someone who tells the truth, the quality of being honest. Truth My dear children, always speaks truth. Friendship Friendship means familiar and liking of each other's mind. Hospitality Hospitality is about people welcoming other people into their homes or other places where they work or spend their time. Tolerance Tolerance means capacity to endure pain or hardship. Tolerance is giving to every other human being every right that you claim for yourself. And faith. Faith, complete trust or confidence in someone or something. Mm -hmm. 
Next one is cultural values. Cultural values. Becoming well mannered and cultured is an essence of the society. Irrespective of language and religion, people live together in harmony. This helps to maintain cultural values. We are all humans. We must live together as brothers and sisters. Next, social values. Dear children, how should you behave in public places? We should maintain the following good values in public places. First, maintain good relation with people. Respect elders. If a child learns to respect his peers and his elders from a young age, there is no doubt that he will benefit from this in the future. Protect nature. We should protect nature because we destroy our home and others' home. Earth is our home. We have love it and caring it if we take care of it. Be tolerant. Willing to accept behavior and beliefs that are different from your own, although you might not agree with or approve of them. Maintain friendship. Good friends are like stars. You don't always see them, but you know they are always there. Next, disciplinary values. Dear children, what are the disciplinary values? They are punctuality, involvement, treating everyone as equal, doing work on time, holding morals, discharging duties without fail and so on. The last one is constitutional values. They are safeguard public properties, maintain unity and integrity of the nation, develop scientific attitude, protect natural resources, care for the environment, honor national symbols, respect martyrs and their sacrifices. Martyrs means a person who sacrifices something of great value and especially life. Preserve our cultural values and heritage. Develop patriotism. Patriotism means love for or devotion to one's country. Dear children, what are the factors that enrich good values? Are literacy, awareness and interest, try hard till succeed, evaluate oneself, acceptance and self-confidence. Each student should be taught to be hygienic, which is the most significant part of good values. One must follow the routine below. Dear children, wake up early in the morning. Bathe every day. Brush your teeth. Comb your hair and cut your nails. Wear clean clothes. Wash hands before and after meals. Okay students, did you understand today's class? A recap of what we have learnt in this class. Good values are developed by practicing them. Honesty is the best policy. Good values are classified into five types. They are personal values, cultural values, social values, disciplinary values and constitutional values. Personal value is the basic value for an individual. Cultural values becoming well mannered and cultured is an essence of the society. We should maintain the good values in public places. The aim of education is to change a person into a valuable human being. Today's children are 
tomorrow citizens of the nation okay students i hope you have understood today's class thank you